GFL Memorial Gardens in Sault Ste. Marie on a Friday night. The ground's coming off that victory, so I look forward to this game here, Jared. Barrett Hayton, Keegan Howdeshell. Roman Puchuk, you're starting three forwards. Laguerre, Hallowell, the defenseman, grounds in their home white with red trim. In front of the puck there by Sambrook. There's a shot, Volta kicks that to the near side. It's batted on a midair and back to neutral territory. Grounds, Morgan Frost, leading scorer, shot wide as he comes into this evening. 12 points on the year. McKay let it go behind the net, sent in front, scores! Put it in tight on Richardson and batted in behind him to open the scoring 108 into the first period. Morgan Frost takes and successfully wins the faceoff over Eric Guest. Puck hammered around the ground zone, but Damiani to Gareffa. Back to him. In from the right point. Right to the goal. Trying to get a glove side. Matthew Valalta looked over as the Valalta. And now back to the point. Left side. Shot wide. Coming back in towards Sobrango. And the Hounds get it to the red line. Matthew Valalta. Now one on one with Morales. Big glove save. His biggest save of the evening here. Lone Ranger forward. They're changing it behind him. He'll dump it, then head to the bench from behind the ground goal. Well, for Trot, his pass off the leg of Frost. He'll get in behind Campbell, move it to the right side. Lot of speed. Hallowell scores! High over top the right shoulder. Blocker side on Richardson. And Mac Hallowell makes it 2 nothing Hounds. And then it's hammered down and in by McPherson. Another one of the acquisitions. And by GM Mike McKenzie of the Kitchener Rangers uh, early in this season. Legary for the ground. Over the line to the right side, Morgan Frost tried to backhand it across. And McKay tried to chop it off his man stick. Couldn't. Here's Gareffa, one-on-one. Can be joined to his right side on man. Rush! Glove save by Valalta as he... And how to show who was calling for it. And as McHugh took it to center, Barrett Hayton regains it for the home side. Three and a half to go here in the second. Here's how to shout through one man, through the other, to the goal scores! <laughs> through two men, and under the outreach pad of Richardson, Keegan how to shout makes it a 3 nothing game. Back on the stick of Ryan O'Rourke. And it bounces out in neutral territory. Scooped up by how to shell, a little bit off strike. And he could have been looking to move it across there to Barrett Heen, but that didn't work. Rangers inside the ground zone on the far wall towards the net. Tucking scores. Side of the goal, Ricard Hogg. They'll break the goose egg on Matthew Valalta, and it's a 3-1 hockey game. Well, the puck uh, eventually got to the side of the goal, and Hogg, good pace. Territory, Hallowell gets the puck. Transitions between a pair of hounds. Frost high in the air. How to shell. Neutral territory. Force some way through. It's off the legs of Barrett. Hayden scores. And then into the corner there to the right of the goal. But your captain, second in as many nights, insurance marker, Hounds ahead 4-1. Outside of center. As Jordan Sambrook retreats to the corner, he'll move the puck to center ice. And for the second straight game, the Crowns will post a 4-1 victory. This time it's a Friday night, and it's against the Kitchener Rangers.